everybody it's all about uh, Detroit DD15 engine that's uh, 2010 uh, we have here um, pressure fuel pressure rail and uh, that's how exactly it's located at the engine but uh, my I had a check engine on the truck and I was um, and the check engine light when we run it with the computer the check engine light was about the uh, rail pressure governor all valves still uh, stay open so I was trying to find a picture location or something where that valve located and comes out that the valve is all the way on the back on the pressure rail and it looks like that so that's actually pressure rail valve so the only one thing is do is just do this holes when the valve is inside like that so it's close and open that channel so the diesel can go out inside the rail and also right so then to maintain the pressure inside so the pressure rail consists of that three part basically right here that one is the pressure rail valve which is this one and it's hiding on the back of your pressure rail it's not just a bolt it's just it's a valve which i was trying to find and the pressure rail sensor which is right here and it can be two different check engine lights one for the pressure rail sensor and second one for the pressure rail one and again everybody that's how it looks and this is a damage valve we took out of the truck here you can see the part number and if you're interested what was wrong remember I was saying that the computer is saying that the valve pressure rail valve stock open so that's how it looks like see that pin inside in the middle uh, it's visible uh, while the one we install the pin was inside so you you couldn't see that so that's how uh, it looks when it's stuck open and when we change it the trouble code just disappeared immediately